Howdy folks, my name is Lanso90 and welcome to Let's Play Leg Breaker. So I was just looking for a game to round out our week this week because we beat Far Sky a little bit early. <laughs> so uh, we're going to take a look at Leg Breaker. It's a game that's been uh, a little bit popular lately. So I thought we'd try to get a look here and see what it's all about. It's free on itch.io. Of course, you should uh, tip the developer if you like the game. Well, Congratulations. You have been selected to take part in an experiment. Dot dot dot. Abducted. Never mind that. May I continue? You have been selected as the primary test subject for LB0206. Injected in solution to the quadriceps allows for tremendous vertical leap. What's more, it only has one side effect. The first stages of the experiment will begin promptly. Look sharp. All right, so this is sort of like a portal kind of inspired game where uh, the na the game style is going to make sense here shortly. Let's put it that way. But uh, we'll play Philip J. Fry here and uh, let's go ahead and break our legs. My leg is broken. Let's go ahead and break our leg again. All right, we made it to the exit. <laughs> so yeah, that's the, that's the gist of the game here. You have two legs. Clearly, I don't know. Do you know anyone who has more than two legs? And uh, you can only jump twice. Which means you got to make them count. Right. That's two down. And obviously, it's going to start getting a little bit more complicated as we go, as puzzle games tend to do. Um, well, I hope that we can jump all that length without landing on that middle piece because ah, I know what that was the uh oh yep we're done uh, we press R to restart there we go okay well how are we gonna do this then can we jump nah oops that was that was my bad entirely how are we gonna do with this, do this with two jumps do we have momentum to get across the gap? No. So we've got to jump over the gap. It doesn't really matter if we do it this way, or I guess it does apparently. <laughs> Am I missing something over here? No. All right, let's go down here again, break our leg. I need to think about this one. All right, I'm a little embarrassed because I did have to look this one up. I tried and tried. Um, what I couldn't see here is that there's actually a crawl space in between these sections. So you just jump twice and you can crawl through that. I assume that was a solid wall. Otherwise I might have thought of that, but I don't know how long I might have been there trying to figure that out. But at least we know that's something they tried to do to us now, right? All right, so now how about this bad boy? I have a feeling with this one, if we go down any further, we're probably not going to make it across on our jump here. I may have been right. Seemed like that was right. All right. Um, help. <laughs> this one seems a little... Can I reach this first platform? Maybe. Okay, let's look for a little crawl spaces. I <laughs> uh, don't see a crawl space here, up there. I don't know. It doesn't seem like I can make this. Okay, I can't make that jump. Okay, I just couldn't make the jump the first time. I don't know why. But there you go. Get to our door there. All right, that wasn't so bad, was it? No, nope, we only broke our legs over and over and over. It's like the opposite of Portal because your legs do don't break in Portal. You can test your performance in a variety of situations. I said, sure, sure you, when you finish the mall, you'll be compensated well. You'll be the judge of that YouTube. Hit that like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. This research facility operates quite differently. I dare say more efficiently than the others. Now then carry on. Carry on my wayward son. All right, we got ourselves a button. We've played Portal. We know how to press buttons. Are you going to give me a companion cube next? Okay. So this one's a little different. The door is right next to the entry door.
think we'll see so we need one jump to get up here fall down onto this uh we have to fall onto the button at least though okay i don't know if we can fall that far okay it did work I'd say the biggest question is, should we jump up over or should we just go under? Let's just go under. Try the simplest way first and then we can try more complicated things if it doesn't work. All right, so this one, button's on the left. We'll have to jump up to get there from this side. Okay, and then we jump back up and fall down on the door, right? Sorry, I'm doing, I'm doing the puzzle in my head before I <laughs> actually go. Probably isn't the most fun to watch, but there we go. All right, got ourselves a little heart-shaped room here. Two jumps. We have to end at the top. Oh, okay, uh, let's see. End at the top. Uh, <laughs> All right, let's just try things oh okay we can just press one button oh maybe that's just demonstrating that you don't have to press all the buttons you only have to press one okay i mean we've got to jump here uh but we only have to press one button so we don't have to go get that one that's way over there we can just eat ourselves up this little tunnel here uh Okay, now the new question is, can we crawl over one tile wide gaps? We can. All right, that, that solves everything. I have a feeling that that button that was near the door was there purposely to do what it did to us, trick us into thinking we press that first. Here to deliver news. The following tests will incorporate some more dangerous obstacles. Dot, 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 by the way. Oh, don't worry. It's really nothing worse than what you've already been patched up for. That said, break a leg. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. I wasn't expecting that joke. Ha ha ha. Alright, how are we going to fall on that button? Mm hmm. Okay. I think what you want me to do is jump up onto this, fall down onto the button, and then jump up again. All right, we did it, we did it. Uh, do not walk to the left. I wonder how many people get caught up on that crawly hole at the start, because, oh, huh? Nope, oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's right there. I wonder how many people get caught on the crawling hole at the start. There we go. Let's... Ooh. Okay, so our broken leg will allow us to crawl in through there. There we go. There's spikes in there, though. We made it. Gotta press the button. Ooh, is this like an... I think this is a crawling situation. Ooh, we can't crawl, though. We'll break our head. Break our legs here. <laughs> you thought you could up. <laughs> well, how are we going to press that without breaking our legs? Okay, I see. Fall here. Yump. Okay, we got to nail that landing, which is going to be a little tricky. Okay, it works. Send yourself, jump, crawl. Told you I could do it. Told you. Got some super meat boy stuff going on here. Spikes on all sides. Maybe it's more of a I want to be the guy situation. Do this. Break our leg. Leg. Yo. I just realized that's going to make the perfect thumbnail. We got to put the my leg fish into this falling straight down seems too easy to be honest with you seems like a dirty trick i think it's a dirty trick i don't think we need to press i think we need to press that one that's further away just 
Just thinking, just thinking. Ah, oh, I think we can do that. I think that one next to us is a trick. I don't think we're supposed to actually go that way. I was like way too far back. That was just impatience. That's also impatience. I mean, we can, I can demonstrate to you that this is not the way to do it, but there you go. <laughs> there you go. All right. Okay, we'll just walk into the spike. That's gonna happen, okay, it's gonna happen. Classic I wanna be be the guy stuff. Bruh. I don't know how to do this one. I, we did it the first few times and then I lost it, okay. Feels like it to me. Can we do like a a midair jump? Kind of. Am I wrong? No, I can't be right. <laughs> Hold on. Is there any secret crawl spaces or anything? I don't see one. That feels right, man. That feels like what we've got to do, but we're not able to make that jump. I'll give it a few more tries and then I'll have to look it up if I can't figure it out. Cause am I missing something? I only see the two buttons. Okay, I was right. It just, I had to time it differently. One of those very tricky things to figure out. That wasn't bad at all, was it? Dot, dot, dot. Well, I'm glad you had fun. Before you go on, though, there are some paperwork you need to sign. It's for your eventual deposit. Dot, 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 by the way. No, oh, please, $50 is more than fair. Nothing but ingrates in the slab. Astonishing. Okay. All right, let's see what I gotta do. Gotta break our leg here and then move forward. Wait, what? What happened there? Because I realized I did it wrong and then it just it let us through. <laughs> um. I don't know. You can press both buttons in some situations, I think. And I don't know what that does, but let's go ahead and do it. There you go. Maybe it's just automatically presses both buttons to show you that you can press more than one. There is two red dots on the doors now. Door is open, but do we want to get both switches? What do we get out of using both switches though? I did it. <laughs> I don't know what it does, but I did it. Now this one, I don't see us hitting all of them, but it also, uh, maybe it's just like how many, maybe the red bars indicate how many you need to press. So like, I don't have to press all four here. Uh, okay. Well. That's good, but we could do better, right? my bad. I was trying to jump back up through the middle there. Careful. They hit two buttons at once. There you go. There you go. 
I thought you could outsmart me. Why does this one look easy? Oh, well, we don't step on the button. You have to actually land on a button to press it down. Okay, it's not deep enough. What if I do it here? Can you not thread that needle? we have to swoop through, which is going to be a little tricky. Gotta keep going, man. Uh, this is going to be a nightmare of timing. I almost need like less FPS here because this is what we've got to do. I can see this is what it wants us to do. There we go. Ways though, which is horrible. Okay, we did it. We did it. I did it. I did it. I'm bad at timing puzzles. Hello, Logan. How are you feeling? Of course, that's a great to hear. Besides checking in, I need to inform you of a small situation. A few of our other volunteers have run amok. There seems it may there may be a breach in the next hallway after this batch of tests. Like getting into the back of the back rooms and portal. Urgent concerns elsewhere will prevent me from personally escorting you through. But you must, I repeat, must continue to the next testing station. After all, you're not even halfway done. I don't know when halfway is going to be, by the way. I don't know if we're going to make this two videos or one video. Okay, so. No more buttons, but I think they introduced springs here. I'm dead. <laughs> Hold on. Interesting. My idea was I kind of want to land on the spring and then go into that left tunnel. I don't know what that does for us, but... We did just see that we can... It does seem momentum based like the further you fall onto it the smaller jumps you I think we can if we fall here and go left which is easier said than done again I think we're like I'm being punished for high frame rate here that's what I wanted to do that's what I wanted to do are you going to kill me? No. Hey, we got through with only breaking one leg. That's a new one. There. Hold on. So we need more momentum, I think. So I think we want to... Oh, man. <laughs> I could be overthinking it. I'm trying to jump into the... I guess I guess it doesn't matter if I fall in, right? Okay, never mind. I mean, I guess let's just try this normally first. Is that makeable without interfacing with the spring? <laughs> That's the big question. Okay, I jumped too soon. Okay, I even have to interface with that spring, I suppose. Kind of odd that it's there, but it's okay. Uh, this is one where it'd prefer for us to hit two buttons. Curious about is can I get to that far right button before hitting any of the others? No. If I can jump and land on this, then get up here. Okay, 
Hold on. Hold up. Uh, we need to land on that button. I think we jump over, land on this button. Jump down, land on that button. Jump up and get out. We did it. <laughs> he actually did it. I don't know if that would have bounced us all the way back up to where we were, but I'd like for it to. It did. Then I would say... Something like this. Hold on. I messed up that one. So we'll drop down on the spring. Uh, go back and hit that. Drop down on the spring. It's harder than it looks. <laughs> Turns out when you can only jump once in the game, it makes it hard to like re-attempt something, right? Oh, man. Like you, ha you have to restart if you mess up. You can't go back and try to jump again. Why didn't that bounce me? Is it a one-time use spring? I think it is a one-time use spring now. That's okay. I think this is still what we want to do. Can I land on the button and spring at the same time? That's the big question. little flop. Okay. Um. This feels closest. I know we can just do like a one door one door opening perhaps. do, but I don't know if I have the strength to do it. He's done it. <laughs> All right. So this one was looking a little spicy. I think we're going to end the episode here since it says we're maybe close to halfway through. So I hope you all enjoyed. We'll be continuing this in the next video on my channel. It'll be uploaded tomorrow. If you enjoyed it, remember to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you want to see more. Until next time, hope you have a good day.